What's up everyone? Dave with Epconcrete and today we're going to talk about why does concrete crack? Here's three minutes of why with your foundation guy. Okay, so today we're going to talk about why does concrete crack? Let's set the timer for three minutes and I'll try to get you an answer before the time runs out. So why does concrete crack? We get asked that question, especially since it's in our name, Ep Concrete, all the time. One of the guarantees we do give people is that concrete will crack. It always cracks. Understand one thing. Concrete is made up of a lot of water. So think of it like your favorite sweater. When you wash your favorite sweater, you're introducing a lot of water into that product. When it dries, it shrinks. Also think of it like a sponge that sits next to your sink that you wash your dishes with. That sponge, when it's full of water, is full and it's plump. But when it dries out, it shrinks. The same is kind of true with concrete. That is the main reason why concrete actually does crack is because when the water that's in it evaporates out, it cracks. Most people don't realize that 20 to 25 percent of concrete is actually made up of water. So anytime you take away 25 percent of anything, it's probably going to shrink and thus cracking. So what can cause excessive cracking? There's several things on the list that can cause and maybe make cracking worse. One of those might be the contractor added too much water on the job site or at the concrete plant they added too much water. So they actually weakened the concrete by putting too much water into the product itself. Another reason could be rapid drying. Maybe it's really hot or maybe it's really windy and the top of the concrete got dried out thus you might got some surface cracks or some excessive drying too quickly of the concrete. Another reason might just be improper strength of the concrete. Different items or projects might require different strengths of concrete. Like a driveway might not need to be quite as strong as a street that's accepting semi or bus type traffic. Another big one that we see all the time and you probably see all the time and don't even realize it is wrong placement or not enough relief or control joints. So when you're walking down the sidewalk and you're walking your dog and you see all those little lines in the concrete, those are control joints. The contractor put those in telling the concrete where he wanted the concrete to crack. So if you don't have enough of those in, that concrete, when the water evaporates like we talked about in the beginning, evaporates out of the concrete, it will just decide where it wants to crack as opposed to where the contractor is trying to tell the concrete where to crack. Sometimes people are pretty upset when they see cracks in concrete, but that doesn't mean that that concrete is any less sufficient for what it should be doing. It just means that it might not look as pretty as you wanted it to look. I hope that answers all of your concrete questions and why does concrete crack? And this was Dave with Ep Concrete, and that was your three minutes of why with your foundation guy. Also, if you found this video helpful, make sure to hit the subscribe button up above and also go and follow us on Facebook for other videos that we might release on other products and issues in the industry.